pick up the family and hit the road in this brand new 2021 Grand Design Imagine 3250BH. What's up everybody, this is Chris Fry coming at you from the beautiful Great Escapes RV Super Center and I am pleased to show this RV off to you all today. Starting out here with the front, as you can see you have a power tongue jack. This comes in extremely handy. You also have a convenience light to operate it at night. You do have two 20 pound propane tanks which you fill upon your purchase as well as provide you with a battery. I like that they have this little diamond guard rock plate on here. This helps as far as rock chips goes. You have a fully molded fiberglass front cap on here with the updated uh, LED running lights. You can imagine what that looks like at night. Fiberglass sidewalls. This is a 21 foot full span awning with the built in LED light strip. Guys, look at this pass-through storage in here. So much room, aluminum substructure, heated and enclosed four seasons camper with the upgraded slam latch baggage doors, my personal favorite. It does have manual jacks, but get you guys a three quarter inch socket, hook that up to a drill that will raise and lower much faster than if you had to do that manually. I love that this has dual entry. Of course, the front entry will go into the main bedroom for the queen size bed. And then the back portion will lead into the kitchen area. You do have a section out here where you can have an outdoor mounted TV. You have 110 power as well as a cable TV or satellite output. This is a uh, tank flush for being able to wash out your black tank. They do include the step above entry step upgrade, which is pretty sweet. It touches the ground completely, makes it that much easier as far as entering and exiting goes. Aluminum rims, Dexter axles. You've got a nice setup with the Lion's Head tires as well. I like the little kitchenette back here. It comes in really handy. You got a nice little Attitude refrigerator. A little storage section right here and a suburban two burner cooktop to be able to cook breakfast and stuff in the morning. LED lights, hidden hinges, additional storage, and it all tucks away nice and neat. This is a bunkhouse floor plan. The Solera awning does have a pitch adjustment, so if you guys want to pitch that awning to one side or the other, you guys could, depending on how the way you want the rain to roll off. You have a spray port mounted here on the back. This comes in really handy. You guys can rinse the kids off, rinse your shoes off, rinse the dogs off. Very cool. Tubular bumper on the back. You guys can be able to put your uh, sewer hose in there. You got a full size spare tire. This is a 50 amp service. It actually has two AC on here, uh, LED lights. You're pre-wired for a backup camera. Of course, access ladder to get onto your roof. This is slide outs on the slide. Your bunk room's in the back. Coming around here, they have a nice little convenience light. So if you guys are dumping, you guys will be able to do that at night. You'll be able to have a nice proper amount of lighting. Uh, coming through here, you can see the opposite side of your pass-through storage. As you can see, nice spacious room in here. You've got your docking center for everything to be all hooked up. You've got your outside spray port for your out, uh, outside shower. It does have a hot connection as well. Battery disconnect, you guys can shut this off, prevent any kind of vampire energy potentially draining those batteries. I like this. So you guys have your fresh water hose hooked up to here. You guys actually have the 110 power section right here. So if you have a heated hose, you guys can plug that in and prevent your hose from heating or from freezing. Very cool. Um, cable TV and satellite uh, inputs, uh, but also the ability it shows you to go to each, uh, each room as well on the slam latch baggage doors. Sweet. Let's go inside and check this RV out. So as far as the weights and specs on this RV, unloaded vehicle weight is 8,496 pounds. Your hitch weight is 844. This has a gross of just uh, over 10,195 pounds and 36 foot 11 long. Very cool. Coming into here, so the first thing that I notice, of course, is right here. This is a cool thing. You don't see many RVs that have this. I personally like this quite a bit because, you know, you're setting up to come in or you're leaving and you want to put your shoes on. This is a nice little area right here. You can sit down, put your shoes on, maybe store some stuff, you know, up and top. You've got your section down there for your, uh, your, your breaker panels section right there to be able to put some jackets. Here's your control center right here. You guys can be able to operate everything from here or the convenience of your phone. You can connect it through the Bluetooth capabilities. Hidden hinges. Very nice. I like this as well. 
has a uh, on off and motion sensor um, setting that's very nice you're gonna see right here this is a 5000 BTU in a flame fireplace this comes in handy as well in the summertime so if you want to set the mood but you guys don't want to technically have it put out any heat you guys can do that and then you also have uh, multiple light settings as well you guys can change that to your own desire very cool TCL flat screen TV comes in very handy down here you've got the Jensen AM FM Bluetooth CD DVD player it's got multi-zone selection as well a and B so you guys can be able to play it on the inside or on the outside just be careful and when you're watching a movie make sure your zone B is turned off because that is the exterior portion and uh, everybody around your campsite would be able to hear you <laughs> nice setup on the kitchen I like this a lot I personally like this a lot. This is a perfect family camper. If you got kids or maybe you just have guests that you constantly have come with you to sleep, uh, you know, this back portion has a nice little bunk room, which we'll get into a little bit more. You've got an island here with the solid surface look countertops, chef style faucet, very nice. You've got the vegetable drying racks in there as well. Nice setup. You have the Fire uh, Furion uh, three burner stovetop and oven combo. Does have a convenience light as well. So if you move around at night, uh, nice hood. So if you fry in the bacon, high point microwave, more cabinet storage, a Dometic eight cubic foot refrigerator. I like the little pantry area that they have here as well. You always go to you know some RVs and you're always looking, there's not enough storage. I like that Grand Design is definitely tailoring to that. Um, nice setup on the booth dinette. This uh, will actually turn into a bed as well. Hooray! Very nice. You have the Thomas Paine Collection upgraded theater style seating. The uh, reason why I say that is it does have the built-in convenience light, uh, built-in heat and massage with variable speed settings. You got a little USB charge port right here as well. Very nice. And a section to be able to keep all of your uh, remotes. We'll go from the front and then kind of move our way to that back portion as well. I kind of like that bunk room. I kind of save that one for last. Uh, Pass-through bathroom. I like that. It's got a carousel style shower, walk-in, uh, nice little setup with the medicine cabinet and the vanity. I love this as well. I love an RV that comes standard with a porcelain toilet. That's a very cool upgrade to have compared to the plastic ones. Little 12 volt fan right here as well. You have a um, queen size bed and it does have power outlets on both sides, 110 and USB charging. So that is pretty sweet. And if you do have a CPAP machine, uh, that will operate it as well. Here's a cool and convenient little thing. This is kind of a little trick. A lot of people don't know this, but of course you have an on and off setting, but if you guys press it twice, first time it goes blue, press it again and it'll go white. Now in the Jayco's you have to hold it down to be able to go white. So just as an FYI, but that's pretty cool. Overhead compartment storage, like I said, hidden hinges, very sturdy frame, vaulted ceilings. You have your other Furion um, AC unit right here. I love the nice little quick drop down that you guys can have. Be able to cool this RV off very fast. It's got your um, thermostat, privacy curtains as well. Of course, this RV is going to have emergency exits, carbon monoxide, smoke detector, things like that. You got your blackout shades, a lot of pocket doors in here as well. Very nice. Let's go check out this bunk room. This is my, this is the, the part I'm looking forward to. Holy moly. So, okay. Very nice. So you've got two bunks on the, uh, the left side and then you have two bunks on the right side. But I like that on here, this is able to tilt down to sleep more people or you go to Lowe's or Home Depot, get you your Tupperware bins. There's a lipper right here. You can actually take this mattress out and this just doubles up as additional storage. I like that a lot. I love the modular ability back here where you can sleep friends and family or, you know, you could technically even turn it into an office. Um, you know, you have that ability to be able to make pretty much this rear section uh, what you please with plenty of storage, more drawer storage below on both sides awesome and then cabinet storage right here another section to be able to do a tv to entertain the friends and family and usb charging and 110 power ports 
Very cool RV, guys. This is sweet. Ladies and gents, this is just a brief introduction to this RV. There's still so much that goes into it. Uh, we are the home of no documentation and prep fees. We include a free training class with all new and used purchases. And we take it a step further. When you buy an RV, you're gonna need the sewer hoses, you're gonna need fresh water drinking hoses, all that kind of stuff. We supply that to you actually as a kit. Um, to top it all off, the icing, the creme de la creme, we have a free private campground that we include for all new and used purchases. So when the day comes for you to pick up your RV, we've got it parked at the campground, all fired up. We teach you how to use it, press your buttons, turn your valves, get comfortable with it. If you have questions, you're still here. Ladies and gents, thank you so much for your time and the opportunity to do business together. I ask that you please like, subscribe, comment, and share. We hope to see you soon. Happy camping. Family.